To this day, I don't know where they are. The end of the line for the Muslims of Bosnia. Despite our millions of words, despite the pictures of all our television colleagues, have we journalists made the slightest difference to this tragedy? These men and women were driven out of their homes this morning. Muslims, dispossessed, homeless, betrayed. Why did they throw the Muslims out of Bosnia? Why have they done this to you? Can I ask you, why are you leaving Bosnia? In the Middle East, as well as Bosnia, I've spent 17 years writing about these people. It would be nice to think the world listened to us journalists occasionally, but governments have grown used to ignoring our reports. If you still believe in the new world order, you shouldn't be watching this. Governments want us to think about peace in the Middle East. They'd rather we never saw this, never wrote about it. They'd rather we shut up. Sadika, this is you? Yeah. Sadika, yes. This is you. Yes, and this? Yes. Your husband. Yes. He's dead. And and this here is This is your yes. mother here who's yes. sitting behind you now. Yes. What do you think when you look back at these days now? For these Muslims, this is their moment of despair their day of catastrophe. An hour ago, they were Bosnian Muslims in their own homes. Now they are refugees. Just a little local train to take them north to a refugee camp, another country, to another world, to be scattered to the ends of the earth.